You're listening to the American Democracy Minute, keeping your government by and for the people. Good news today. April 13th, the Minnesota House approved the HF3 Democracy for the People Act, which proposes reforms to voter registration, protects voters from intimidation, and requires disclosure of dark money donors influencing elections. The reform package now becomes SF3 in the Minnesota Senate, where it's likely to be passed and sent to Governor Tim Waltz after the Democratic Farmer Labor Party swept elections last fall. SF3 would automatically register voters doing business at the Minnesota Departments of Safety and Human Services unless voters opt out. A similar provision passed in Colorado in 2020 registered 250,000 new voters in one year. The bill also allows pre-registration of 16 and 17 year olds while they're still in school and first registering for a driver's license. Other reforms allow voters to be added to a permanent vote by mail list and prohibit voter intimidation and deceptive actions intended to interfere with voting. It also aids non-English speakers with alternate language ballots or provides interpreters. Like Arizona's recent constitutional amendment, it will require disclosure of donors to dark money nonprofits and LLCs and bans contributions from foreign donors. If passed, the Democracy for the People Act will be one of the top reform bills of 2023. We have links to details, articles, and groups taking action at AmericanDemocracyMinute.org. I'm Brian Beal.